गुड मॉर्निंग डेयर स्टूडेंट्स टूडे वी विल लर्न अबाउट चेंजिंग फिगर्स एंड देयर एंगल्स एंड वी आल्सो लर्न हाउ टू मेक आर डिग्री क्लॉक स्टूडेंट्स टू अंडरस्टैंड चेंज इन एंगल्स विद चेंजिंग फिगर्स लेट्स डू एन एक्टिविटी स्टूडेंट्स कलेक्ट सम रबर्स ऑफ द वॉल्स ऑफ अ साइकिल ट्यूब एंड सम मैच स्टिक्स नाउ रिमूव द ब्लैक पार्ट ऑफ द मैच स्टिक्स take three match sticks and three rubber balls and join them after joining three match sticks and three balls of the cycle tube our triangle is looked like this see students this is the side of a triangle when two sides or line segment meet at a common point it form an angle that common point is called the vertex so students Angle of a triangle are one, two, and three. Now, students, let's attach one more matchstick and a valve of a cycle tube in a triangle and make a figure of four line segment. There are four sides of this figure. Let's see how many angles are in this figure. One, two, three, and four. students now we will make one more figure of five side by adding one more matchstick and a valve of cycle tube our figure is look like this let's see how many angles are there in this figure 1 2 3 4 and 5 students similarly make a six side figure and see how many angles are there in this figure let's count 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 so students as the number of sides are increased the number of angles are also increased students do you know triangles are used in the constructions of monuments and bridges with the use of triangles in the construction they become more stronger because triangles evenly distribute weight without changing their proportions students let's find some places in our surrounding where triangles are used except these there are many other places where triangles are also used students now let's make a degree clock firstly take a piece of paper and cut it in a shape of circle then fold it into half after that fold it into 1/4 again fold it one more time students now open the page you will see the lines like this now we will draw lines with colorful pencil or sketch color see here we have drawn all the lines Now you will write angles on these lines as shown: zero degree, forty-five degree, ninety degree, one eighty degree, etc. Students, as you see, we have written angles on our degree clock. Now we will make an arm for our degree clock. Now we will fix our arm with the help of pin on degree clock and paste our degree clock on a cardboard Students now our degree clock is ready See students our arm is on 0 degree angle now arm is on 45 degree angle here arm is on 90 degree or right angle now arm is on 135 degree angle and now arm is on 180 degree angle students tell me what will be the half of 90 degree or right angle yes it will be 45 degree angle students now tell me what will be the double of 90 degree or right angle it will be 180 degree angle so students today we have learned that when figures are changed then angles are also changed and also we have learned that how to make our degree clock 
today's question how many angles are there in the given figure we have four options option a six angles option b five angles option c seven angles and option d four angles students see this figure carefully let's count number of angles in this figure 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 and 7 there are seven angles in this figure so our correct answer is option c seven angles now it's time for homework students try to make these given figures and do questions of page number 167 related with degree clock thank you have a nice day